It's time to register for classes at Fullerton College. In this video, we are going to guide you through the process of registering on the My Gateway Student Portal. Locate the login area and enter your credentials. Don't know your ID or PIN number? Use the links here to retrieve your information. Your ID can be retrieved using your email address used on your admissions application and your date of birth. Your PIN can be retrieved using the last four digits of your social security number and the email address on your admissions application. Once you are logged in, check to see when you can begin registering by clicking on Check Registration Appointment. Remember, you can register any time after your set appointment, but not before. If a time is not listed, you need to apply to the college online. Once you are ready to register, click on Add Drop Classes. Each course has a five-digit course reference number you use to register. Course reference numbers can be viewed in the class schedule, available online. If you receive an error, click on the error message for more details. There are multiple types of errors that may occur. If you have further questions on how to resolve an error, contact the Admissions and Records Office. If the course is full, there may be additional steps to add on to a waitlist if waitlist seats are available. To place yourself on the waitlist, use the drop-down menu and select Waitlist. Then, click on Confirm Your Choices. Waitlist students are not guaranteed enrollment into a course. You can only be on one waitlist per course. You will be notified if a seat is available through the Personal Announcement section, and you can check your waitlist status under Registration Tools. Your position on a waitlist will be indicated here. If this number is zero, you may have up to 48 hours to add this course. If a seat does not become available before the course begins, you may attend the first class meeting in order to petition for a slot in the course. If you obtain a slot in the course, you will be given an add authorization code. To register using the add authorization code, first enter the five digit CRN of the class you are adding. You will be prompted to enter the four digit add code. Don't forget to click on the Validate box after you've entered your ad code. After you have registered for all your classes, you will need to pay your fees. If you are being charged non-resident tuition fees, but feel you may qualify to pay resident tuition, please contact the Admissions and Records Office. Once your registration is complete, make sure to print out your schedule and bill by clicking on Print Schedule Bill in the Registration Tool section. Please check your schedule to make sure you are registered for the correct classes. This schedule is your proof of registration. Make sure to print a new one every time you make changes to your schedule. Here are some things to remember. First, make sure to attend the first class meeting. Any student that does not attend the first class meeting may be dropped by the instructor. Second, always be aware of add, drop, refund, and withdrawal deadlines. You can find these in the class schedule. Three, it is the student's responsibility to add, drop, or withdraw within the published deadlines. Welcome to Fullerton College. You are now a Hornet. Good luck on your journey, and remember, for any questions regarding registration, you can check the registration information in the class schedule book or contact the Admissions and Records Office.